welcome guys welcome guys this is crypto talk right here and this video i'll be showing you how you can connect your node your connect your wallet on node using your phone right i'll show you how to connect your wallet using your phone in this video all right uh some of you have tried connecting your wallet and it's not even showing there's no there's no uh there's no place if you look down here normally you're supposed to see any it's supposed to see any but uh, it's not showing using your phone even though you put the phone on desktop mode it's still the same thing right you can't see where to connect your wallet using your phone so i've shown you in this video how to do it with your phone even if you don't have a laptop i've made a video on using a laptop if you don't watch it please check the comment section and you're gonna see how uh, to connect if you have a laptop or if you're using a phone i'm showing you in this video Please do not subscribe to the channel, kindly subscribe, turn on post notifications, Since I post a new video, you'll be the first to notified about my video. You know what to talk about here, how to make money from crypto, with funds or with zero funds. Please like, share and subscribe to this channel. So the first thing to do is uh, go to your phone, your settings, right? Um, for some of you, you're going to see, on click on about phone, right? Click on about phone and search for either build number. If you're using a Xiaomi phone, just like mine right what you have to do is just um, click on about phone look at about phone here click on it once you click on it then you're gonna see m u m i u version right click on that m i u version tap that m i u version seven times one two three four five six seven and to say you're already a developer are you seeing it that's what it says here but uh, for if you're using uh, other Android phone, just search for about phone, scroll down, you're gonna see build number, right? Once you click on that build number, tap that build number seven times and already to take you to a developer option. It will tell you you're now a developer on your phone. And once you, after doing that, just come to search, right? Search here, all right? Type uh, developer options also developer options and search right once you search you're going to see the develop, develop developer option coming out here and once you click on it you're going to see that you're now your developer option is on right now scroll down keep scrolling you're going to see uh keep scrolling you're going to see uh sweet smaller sweet are you seeing it smaller sweet are you seeing it on that developer options now my is showing 360 dp i don't know what yours is showing but whatever yours is showing i just screenshot it because after connection of wallet we, we're going to put back uh, what is showing so your screen will back to normal all right so on my own that is smaller suite i'm gonna whatever your own is showing just change it to uh change it to 800 right then the 800 and click on what okay right now once you do that your screen is gonna change your screen is gonna change right this is how you're gonna see your screen now go to your settings search for what auto rotates auto rotates so you'll be able to tilt your screen right auto rotate so you'll be able to tilt your screen auto rotate i'll just put it on all right mine is on already so then you now go back to your kiwi browser all right go back to your kiwi browser and what tilt your screen then you can now refresh all right and just wait for it to load please do not subscribe to the channel kindly subscribe turn on post notification then time i post a new video you'll be the first one to find about my video you know what to talk about here to make money from crypto with funds or with zero fund please let me know where you're watching from are you in the usa nigeria ghana let me know in the comment section on which state you're watching from all right if you have any question let me still know in the comment section all right so uh, i'm waiting for it to load up so it's a, it has loaded up now so your screen is now like a laptop all right your screen is now like a laptop and what you have to do now is uh, click on uh, innings right innings guy innings 
Alright, click on innings. You're gonna see innings now, right? Oh, uh, then click on if you don't have a phantom wallet, click on your tab here, right? Open on that tab and search for what phantom wallet chrome extension, phantom wallet extension, right? Once you search for it, the first link on Google is phantom wallet chrome extension. The first link on Google is what phantom wallet chrome extension. Look at it, all right? So I'm, I'm Look at it here then click on it all right it's gonna open up then click what add to chrome all right now once you add to chrome you're gonna see uh, once uh, you click on add to chrome right now once you have added to chrome you're gonna see it's gonna ask you to create what uh, you're gonna see once you have added to chrome it's gonna install and add to chrome and click on this on this uh, on this thing I just circled, right? And scroll down, you're gonna see Phantom, right? You're gonna see Phantom. Sorry, you're gonna see Phantom. Click on that Phantom. Did you see, did you see the Phantom? Hold on. You're gonna see Phantom. Look at Phantom here. All right. Then click on it. All right. Once you click on it, it's gonna open up it's gonna if you have an account already you're just gonna see it if you don't have create an account or if you have just import the one you have already then once you've done that uh, right your phantom wallet is ready then go to go back to the note pay click on innings just like i told you earlier click on innings here yeah. all right then you're gonna see verify your email you're gonna see connect your wallet and confirm wallet address. So I'll now click on uh, our email is verified already. If yours is not verified, click on it to get verified. All right. Then the next thing is to do is what connect your wallet. I click on connect wallet. It's gonna say phantom wallet detected. Are you seeing it? So I'm gonna click on that phantom wallet. All right. Then it's gonna link to my phantom wallet. All right. And ask me to what connect. Hold on. Uh, uh, Phantom is finding I'm, I'm finding it difficult to to connect uh, Phantom wallet. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to just click on I'll, I want to uh, use software wallet, right? So I'll click on software wallet. How do you want to connect? How do you want to connect? So um, you click on use web web wallet, use web wallet, right? Now when you click on use web wallet, it's going to ask you to create a new software wallet, uh, uh, software wallet or import a new uh, this thing or import your key phrase so just import the key phrase of uh, phantom the phantom wallet is just import it into software and you already have a wallet it will be the same wallet do you understand so once you do it import instead of creating new you import when you click on this use web 3 wallet when you click on when you click on use web wallet right it's gonna ask you to what import or import or use import new wallet import old wallet or create a new wallet so click on import now when you click on import you you have your wallets ready then click on use web so now when i click use web 3 wallet it's gonna load up like this now it's gonna because you have finished setting up your wallet it's gonna ask you to connect right so i'll click on connect all right software connected successfully all right it says sign in message i'll click on verify now if your phantom works good and fine right but mine was not working it didn't it's supposed to pop out like this this soft uh, soft place is popping out it's supposed to pop out and ask me to connect my phantom wallet if your own works very good but if it doesn't work you can use this method i just use now all right so i'll click on approve all right i'll click on approve and uh, wait for it all right now you said your wallet is verified you're not gonna see confirm wallet address i'll click on confirm right confirm it says after wallet confirmation there is no way to change your wallet your wallet address connected to this account 
It's your responsibility to ensure that your chosen wallet is correct. I'll say send email. Send email. Then once you click on send email, it's gonna send an email to your email. Then confirm it. Let me go to my email. My email. Let me just open my email inside the Kiwi browser. I think it will be the best. Uh, open your email inside Kiwi browser. I'll just say gmail.com. It's good you open it from there. I think it's best. And confirm from there. Alright. I just log in my account. So guys, on I opened my email inside Kiwi browser. So I'll confirm my wallet from there. I'll just click on confirm. Then it said wallet is verified. Return to dashboard. I'll just click on return to dashboard. Now, on return to dashboard, still click on any. Let's see whether we did the right thing. Any. Right. Any. Any. So if you look here now, you're going to see you have everything connected. Uh, verified. Everything is verified now. Uh, email verified. Wallet verified. Uh, confirm wallet address verified. So you're now good to go. Now you can return your phone back to how you saw it. Now all you have to do is go to settings. I'll go to settings here. All right. Click on. Uh, I can off. I can click on auto retest screen. All right. I can keep my screen normal now. Normal. All right. Keep my screen screen normal. Then uh, I'll click on about phone. Remember about phone. I'll click on about phone. Oh, I'll click on. Okay, I'll just search for developer option. On search first, developer option, developer option. Remember, developer options. Search for it. Once you search for it, click on it. Remember, I then you scroll, scroll down. Right, you're gonna see that. Uh, look for that smallest suite. Smallest suite. Are you seeing it? Smallest suite. All right. Look at smallest suite. If you're if you're seeing it, I don't know what you're seeing. It. If you're seeing it, this is it, right? Smaller suite and change it to what yours was before, right? Mine was 360, so I'll just change it to 360. I don't know what yours was. Whatever yours was, remember I had to screenshot it. Whatever yours was, just change it to it and click on OK, right? Click on OK and your phone is back to normal, all right? It's back to normal. Then you can still click on that developer option, search for it right once it comes out you can now put it off all right this the developer option put it off okay sorry developer options now put it off and you're good to go right put it off so that is all for this video so if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up like your wallet has been connected on kiwi browser right if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up like share subscribe to the channel Alright, I'll see you in the next video. This is Crypto Talker here. Peace out.